what's good ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the channel welcome back to some more ufc career mode featuring xavier lewis we are now seven and zero oh in the ufc after that big elbow driven knockout we had in our last fight against atkinson they've been hounding us about fighting that man we finally fought that man and yeah that might have been a mistake might have been a mistake it was it was it was a waste of our time anyways I think if you look down at this contract goals, we got all these little things. We got a WWWW and a fist. I think we might have to fight Barry Cabrera in this episode. I think we might fight our rival in this one. So let's go ahead and take a look at the fight offers and see if that actually is the case. And there you go. We have no option but to fight our rival, Barry Cabrera, at UFC Fight Night 147 on the undercard. Hype is medium, three weeks until the fight. Of course, we all know how much we're getting paid out here. All right, let's accept the fight. That's our only option. Barry wants these hands again. We'll give him these hands again. Rematch between Xavier Lewis and Barry Cabrera set to take place in Newark, New Jersey. Xavier Lewis will get another chance to prove he's better than Barry Cabrera. UFC officials announced the rematch will take place at Prudential Center. Cabrera, 13-4, said he still has unfinished business with Lewis, 7-0, and, oh, and assured the fans that he would throw down with his rival one more time. As you see that beautiful picture back from the WFA when we knocked him out with that Superman punch. All right, bro. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, sir. Sir, can you chill for a minute? I'm just trying to get my fitness up, bro. I am not trying to, like, get hurt, and I'm not trying to hurt you. So can you chill? Can you chill? Can you chill? Thank you. Let me get off this cage. For real, dog. Like, for real right now. I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to like, get my fitness up, bro. I'm not trying to, like, get hurt. Leave me alone. Let me alone. Let me alone. Let me alone. Retreat. Retreat. Floyd Mayweather. Floyd Mayweather. Floyd Mayweather, this man. Floyd Mayweather, this man. Good I'm just trying to get my fitness up. I'm just trying to get into peak physical condition. Please leave me alone. What's peak at? Where does peak start? Like 70, 97, I think. Oh, 96. All right, so we're in peak physical condition all right perfect perfect all right key to victory your opponent hates spinning strikes a wheel kick will be a perfect tool to use to knock out your opponent i don't how come all the keys to victory are moves that i don't have <laughs> that's not that's not fair jay ellis you got this believe ufc victory Got your back, Jay Ellis. Let's do it. Or let's do this. Always look forward to Jay Ellis' fight. Going to be a good one. It's clear that Jay Ellis doesn't know a left hook from a fish hook. That hurts. Cuts me deep, Trisha Galvin. You're, you're cold-blooded, man. I don't need to be seeing this stuff before I head into the octagon. There he is, that ball headed man with the old man boobies. Where was he from? West Virginia? Virginia? I didn't I didn't see it. I didn't catch it. Because he's so defensively sound. He uses movement and defense. Lightning fast hand speed. Good punching power has won 13 fights in his career. He also got knocked out by Xavier Lewis. Just so you guys know. Just so you're aware. For those of you who don't remember. One punch knockout power. And when a fighter has that kind of ability, it's always a big advantage. What are you doing, sir? You need to settle down. I don't know why you acting so confident. Here we go. The baddest man on the planet hailing from Portland, Oregon, 
USA. None other than Xavier Lewis, a.k.a. XL. They just going to say generic things about me again? Won seven fights in a row by KO. Won seven of last seven fights by KO. Has had seven fights in his career. How come they don't say I got lightning, lightning fast hands or one punch power or like nothing like that? I'm seven and zero with seven knockouts. Clearly, I got knockout power. My hand speed probably could be a little bit faster, but you know it is what it is. It is what it is. All right. So this time, this is my goal. I mean, I'm not. I'm not gonna. If I see an opening, I'm gonna take the opening. But my hold up. Let's look at the tail of the tape. It's an inch taller. I got a three inch reach advantage though. All right. So I think what I'm gonna do this time. I mean, again, if I see an opening, I'm gonna take the opening. If I if I get an opening and knock this man out, I'm gonna knock this man out. But a, I want a clean knockout. Oh, he's from Arizona. Okay, I want a I want a clean knockout. I don't want to I don't want like a ground and pound knockout. I want a clean knockout on this man. And two, I'm gonna try to be patient. I'm gonna try to be patient. I might let this one go to like the third round. I might, I might do that. I might just mess around with this dude and let him get to the third round. Maybe, maybe. If there's an opening, if there's a chance for me to knock him out in the first, then I'll take it. I'll take it for sure. Let him know. Let him know, Bruce. Let him know, Bruce, Bruce. So Dan Mergliata shares the cage. Oh, I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's do it. Oh, okay. Okay. This man coming out hot. Got you. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I'm there. I'm there. Oh, okay. Okay. I tried to throw an uppercut, but for some reason my dude didn't throw it. And then I got caught with one. There we go. There we go. Well, he lands another jab. Really oh, caught him. Caught him. Uh-uh. 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 I'm in constant motion. I'm in constant movement. Constant movement. Looking for angles. Looking for angles. Oh, why did I step back? I didn't mean to step back, though. Okay. We had the same idea. Got you that time. Got you that time. Got you that time. Got you that time. Oh, okay. 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 All right. Nice overhand right. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. That one hurt. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Well, his opponent's got the read now, Joe, as he lands the punch to the head. He's got to change up his striking pattern and the tempo, or he's going to continue. Oh, okay. Oh, ooh. That man came at me with a spinning back fist. Okay. That man looking for he's looking for a knockout. Nice punch. Nice punch. Nice punch. Nice body kick there. I'm gonna go after this man's body. I'm gonna try to wear him down. Oh, he lands a huge kick to the body, Joe. Alright, I'm gonna try to do this. Boom! And then oh that didn't that didn't, that didn't catch him the way I wanted it to. Oh man, he went for it again. He is really Okay. Okay. That is spot on, Joe. Oh my god, why do why are we like every time we like exchange kicks he seems to be getting the better at of it like i seem to be getting a little bit rocked okay he got me that time got me that time i'm there i'm there oh oh i hit the wrong button well, it's one thing to have length. It's another oh. thing to use it, and he does okay. it as well as anyone. Nice kick there, okay. by Lewis. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Come on, exactly. Come on. Oh, he found the target there. That'll work. You wanted this fight. You wanted this fight. You was threatening me on on social media and telling me to watch out for you because you was coming. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to let. These guys are exchanging huge shots. Oh, now he 
has found his timing. He is doling out punishment. Oh, I was going for that spinning back fist and he kicked me in the kidneys. <laughs> oh my god, you probably won the previous round. Your opponent might make some adjustments or come out more aggressively. Be prepared. Oh, I'm prepared. Oh, I'm good. I'm good. And here's a nice kick to the body that lands. Boom. Got him right in their kidneys. He got me on the inside of my knee, though. That's dangerous. Kick to the body. Bam! Man, Lewis throws them kicks out there like he's and looking to kick through more. this man. Kick to the body. Just shins right to the ribs. Some real clean it's not even foot, man. Display. That's like his shin bone right in the ribs, right up under the rib cage. Hello, ladies. How you doing? All right, we going we we gonna try something stupid. Oh, we got it. We got it. <laughs> okay. Trying to All right. That jab once again. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. There's that I am straight up like, I mean, this dude has caught me. Don't get me wrong. He has caught me. But I am straight up like Floyd Mayweather in this dude. I am just hitting him with shots and then ducking out. Oh, I didn't even mean to throw that. That was a beautiful double uppercut combination. Oh, okay. 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 Hey, get off me. Get off me. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Oh, you know what we haven't done today? We have, oh, got him. Got him. Nope. Nope. You still in this? You still in this, bro? Oh, he might be out. Oh, he's landing some good shots here. Oh, huge shot there. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Got a little bit too aggressive. Got a little bit too aggressive. Nope. You ain't gonna get that on me. That's my move. That's my move, sir. I do that. I do that. I do that. Got you. Got you. Oh. Okay. Just over two minutes now to Got you. Got you. Got you. Got you. Very good job timing these shots here. This man getting work. Oh, okay. 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 I see you. I see you. I see you. Superman punch. Got him. And he's looking for that left. Alright, this guy. This dude has a has a much tougher chin than I thought he did. Beautiful timing with the left hand. This man is taking. Got him. Got him. Oh, you ain't done? You ain't done? Okay. Oh my God. This man is standing up to. Okay, he's done. He's done. He's not done. He's not done. <laughs> this man's chin is made. Out. Okay, there we go. There we go. Melted him. Melted him with that uppercut. I was about to say this man's chin is made out of concrete. Caught him clean too. I think he was like, I don't know what he was doing. It looked like he was diving in for a takedown or. Oh no! I hit him and he got rocked. And then that uppercut came. I got him with that jab. Started to go down. Then that uppercut finished him off. That uppercut finished him off. I don't know why he was going down to a jab after all the other shots he took. But okay. Oh, that was devastating. That's exactly what I wanted. That's exactly what I wanted. Melted him with an uppercut. Who's my rival? I don't have any rivals. A rival is someone who has to challenge you. No, he didn't call a stop to this contest. This contest just got stopped. Can't fight if two men ain't on their feet. Well, there have got to be few things sweeter, Joe, than winning a rivalry fight like this in the UFC. And you can see the celebration is on. Well, Barry, I guess it's back to the drawing board for you. Please, please, please don't sit there and try to talk trash on social media because you've now been knocked out twice. I have now knocked you out 
twice. So please don't run your mouth on social media anymore. Please. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. All right. So we landed 53 out of 57 significant strikes. We had three knockdowns, of course. We landed 129 out of 162 total strikes. This man went 28 for 53 on significant strikes. That's pretty good. That's, that's more than half. That's legit. And uh, 34 out of 90 on total strikes. So a lot of his... Uh, he was 0 for 1 on takedown. I don't remember him trying to take me. Oh, was that what... It, so that maybe that, that was what he was doing when I hit him with that uppercut. Maybe he was actually trying to take me down. If that's what happened, then that's dope. If that man was diving for a takedown and got caught with an uppercut, that might be the dopest knockout ever. Trophy earned. UFC 61 bitter rivals. Oh, I hit all my contract goals. Win all fights by stoppage and beat... Oh, beat rookie rival. I, I To be honest, I stopped paying attention to what my uh, contract bonus stuff was. Anyway, our longevity moves down to 96.1. We gained just under 44,000 fans for that one. And, of course, we made $23,000 off that fight. End of story. Lewis ends Cabrera rivalry with a spectacular knockout. The wait was long, but for Xavier Lewis, it was a sweet victory last night in Newark, New Jersey, as he knocked out Barry Cabrera to put an end to a bitter rivalry. Taking advantage of a great training camp and the intensity built up by the back and forth banter with his opponent Lewis was focused from the start and when he landed the finishing blow there was an outpouring of emotion from the problem who secured the most satisfying win of his young career couldn't have said it better myself Dana White congrats Xavier Lewis you're looking like a legit prospect oh you know I look at all those likes look at all them likes Dana White just posted this and he's getting likes. Oh, it only got 180. Stopped at 180. All right. All right. I was getting excited. I was getting way too excited. Contract earned. Xavier Lewis, prospect. A four fight contract. 18,000 a show. 15,000 for the win. Break in my bonus is to break into the top 15. I don't have options, I don't got options. That's it, that's the only contract you're gonna offer me. A four fight contract. You just, you, I just had a five fight contract, and now I got a four fight contract. Oh, I'm probably gonna have to fight like real fighters, like real UFC fighters now, and they want to know if I can <laughs> handle those dudes, which I cannot. All right, we accept it, we'll accept it. Oh, no, 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 no. No, why? Why is Uriah Hall the first person to come at me? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay, for those of you who don't understand what is happening right now, that is because you probably have never seen my UFC 2 career where I was steamrolling everybody. Like, I was knocking everybody out in the first round or submitting them in the second round. Like, I was rolling over everyone. Like, no contest. Until I cross paths with Uriah Hall. And that man gave me that work. When I say he gave me that work, I'm, I mean, he, my stamina was at like 40% by the time we were halfway through the second round. And he absolutely, like he, it took him till the third round and knocked me out. But that man beat me like I insulted his mom. Like that man whooped me badly so the fact that he is the first person to come at me like this all right we good no we good we good we good i ain't shook i ain't shook what's up 
So I'm the next big thing. You're yesterday's news already. Uh, I fight whoever they put in front of me. Maybe you're next. Heard good things about you. I'm sure we'll see each other soon. Uh, next big thing, you wouldn't make it out of the first round with me. Okay, I don't know about all that. I don't know about all that. Yo, I'll fight whoever they put in front of me. Maybe you'll be. Maybe you're next. That's that's what we're gonna do. We ain't gonna show fear, but we ain't gonna get. We ain't gonna like let our mouth write checks that our ass can't cash either. All right, y'all. So yeah. So yeah. It looks like we're gonna have three fights, and then we gotta fight Uriah Hall. Fantastic. 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 All right, y'all. That's going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate each and every one of you. If you're enjoying this series, do me a favor. Hit that thumbs up. It helps me out immensely. If you're new to my channel, be sure to subscribe. Hit the little bell icon and turn on notifications so you can be kept up to date every single time I post a new video. I am out for now. I'm going to go sit in the corner and cry. I will catch y'all on the next one. Peace.